Hello everyone. In this video, I would like to touch base a little bit on how to come up with ideas and the new blog posts uh, titles or topics to write about. So imagine you have a blog post and or you have a blog and you have 10 posts. How do you think about what should I write next? That can be challenging sometimes. So in this video, we are going to brainstorm together with ChatGPT to come up with some ideas. How would we do that? So let me have a little bit discussion and brainstorming with ChatGPT and see where we will end up. Hi. First of all, I like always to give a context, some back background. I have a website about business software where I write blog posts about productivity tools like ChatGPT, Canva, Bluehost, GoDaddy, and so on. I have written many articles and now I am a bit stuck what to write next. I want you to give me some ideas on what to write. And here I will use a technique called ask to answer. So I will tell ChatGPT, ask me any question you need so you can collect more details to be able to answer my request. Let's see. And ChatGPT now is analyzing and it's taking a little time. Of course, I'll be happy to help you come up with some new ideas for your business software blog. The better tailor the ideas to your audience and content focus. Could you provide a bit more information, target audience? So now it's asking me some questions to understand better the background, the context, so it can give me some ideas. And this is very good exercise because also it gives me some uh, ideas or some direction on how to they say run my business or run my blog website. So target audience, here I'll say here are the, here are some additional info. Target audience, audience is people interested in learning about technology. For example, then content tone, the tone of the content is friendly and professional. Friendly and professional. Current trends. Current trends are about AI, generative AI, making money online, um, startups. I'll just throw some ideas. Then specific software categories, challenges. There are many questions. I'm not going to answer everything, but the idea, the concept is clear. So this is a good technique to tell ChatGPT, ask me questions in order for you to be able to answer my request. And let me hit enter and see. Great, thank you. So here it says, here are some blog post ideas that could resonate with your blog or title target audience. Harnessing AR for productivity. Very nice. Explore how AI powered tools like ChatGPT can enhance. Nice. The rise of generative AI. What what does it mean for business? Monetizing your tech knowledge. Nice. Startup spotlight. <coughs> I like them. I like some of these. So you can iterate again and more, or if you want, you can format it. Nice. Put it in a table and add the key words for each title <clears throat> so now we have a table and the keywords okay if you have some knowledge of seo that will help you as well but it's not a must so the title here make the titles more seo friendly that means include a number also make some of the titles in the form of question for example how to blah 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 okay boosting productivity unleashing ai this is much better titles Gener generation ai generative ai how tech savvy 
upcoming and so on okay if you are happy with them you can take for example startup innovation 7 ai powered ventures making waves mm, not the best but the the concept is okay choosing business software five key factors for startup success nice ai revolution in e-commerce enhancing sales and customer experience you can niche more make three more titles targeting the email marketers for example email marketing automation how ai is transforming campaign efficiency very nice okay uh, you can add numbers as well several strategies to boost email engagement with ai so these are all ideas what you can do also you can copy some titles from your blog website and put them into chat gpt until chat gpt these are seven of my previous posts give me three more for example so that's another way to do it but in general this is the concept more or less if you follow and iterate mix the prompt engineering be uh, give always one of my favorite is to give a history or give a background the context draw the context for chat gpt and you will be in a good start okay perfect thank you very much and i'll see you in the next video